Unfortunately, Alien Sky Cult, they did inform us at the last second that they could not make it for this date of the music storm. So we're going to try our best to see if we can bring them on for next week, because, you know, obviously in India right now where they are from, there are some huge circumstances happening, just like how here in America, we kind of seem to feel like the COVID-19 pandemic is sort of coming to an end. Well, that's not necessarily the case when it comes to uh, India, one of the largest countries in the world, one of the hugest populations, because they had their highest single day rise happen just of yesterday. And the wild part is they had over 75,000 cases of people being tested with COVID-19. Um, Marissa, what are your thoughts on everybody kind of downplaying it here in America? Yeah, you know, one of my things I was thinking, you know, when they said they couldn't come is hopefully no one in their family right is experiencing anything going on with covid right now um you know illness death anything so hopefully good thoughts out there for their family to make sure they're safe because india has you know it, it has a disparity of wealth it has a disparity of cleanliness in some areas uh that's one reason why their numbers are so high too there's not yeah, absolutely to running water yeah, absolutely. And you just don't, I just wonder what the climate is because it would be really interesting to ask them on their thoughts of obviously where here in America, we're just uh, getting a bit excited that we're starting to see our first person of color and female be running for uh, vice president of the United States. And what I saw in the Indian Express, which I thought was quite interesting, it's one of the largest newspapers out there in that country. And they said Indians have gone wild with joy. As, and, and to me, I, I'm really curious and I'm curious about that because I wonder, because obviously when we had the last conversation with Alien Sky Cult, they're sort of going through a little bit of a religious war. And, you know, one of the things that um, Marissa and I, you and I have been vocal about is, you know, we've, we've all known that Kamala Harris is, you know, a person of color, but I didn't realize that she was a, a native in, the, in that community as of now. And I wonder why she hasn't talked about that before. And I think we've only heard about that because of the praise that the Indian people are giving here in the United States. Yeah, you know, I mean, from California, obviously she ran the Senate, she was our district attorney. And so her whole platform these last years that I knew was of a black American, which is cool, great. But I was surprised that she's never brought up that I have heard being California, that she's also 50% Indian. Yeah. Uh, and and her mom, you know. So I wonder if does she speak Hindu? I mean, I don't, I don't know. Like I'm so fascinated, and I love the fact that she is two mixed cultures. Um, that she really identifies strongly from what she's talking about now with her Indian mom side of the family, along with her father's black American side of the family. So I'd love to see more of that marriage in our politics and talking. Yeah, and maybe we might hear a little bit of that because I know, you know, when Joe Biden and Kamala Harris, when they first had their joint interview with ABC News, I mean, it came across as like, get to know me kind of story. But I still felt like I didn't know enough of her past heritage, which I think is really fascinating, you know, and if it, the country of India is really jiving with it. I think that's really cool because, you know, with me, with the Chris Collins show, we want prosperity with everybody around the world. And we want to bring one voice and we want peace and equality for everyone. And that's why I think it's important to remind the listeners that it is the 57th anniversary of the March on Washington, where MLK gave his famous speech, I have a dream. And I think that's really powerful. And I know, Marissa, we're about to get uh, geared to play some of Alien Sky Colts music because... Yeah, so we wanted to at least play one of their musics because we've, you know, they've been on the show for so long now, and uh, we're going to be playing one of their tracks. It's called We Are the Damn. Yeah. 